Righty-tighty, lefty-loosey. Wait, I freaking crushed that. I love the way that turned out. Wow, okay, great. Yeah, I mean, I really don't need no man, but I am glad I have him. I never thought I'd see the day. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be doing some Saturday morning redecorating. I recently did a Target and Amazon haul and I found a few new home decor finds that I really wanted to incorporate throughout the apartment, as well as relocating some of the decorations that we had up before. There was nothing wrong with how it was set up before, but I often get the redecorating bug and once I get it, there's just no stopping. So in today's video, I'm going to be incorporating those new pieces into our apartment, as well as moving around some decor that I already had hung, but I wanted to relocate a little bit. I can already tell you guys this video is a good one. All of the different pieces that I've incorporated and some of the things that I've moved around have already made such a huge difference in the apartment. As you can see, we officially have curtains hung. I don't know what it is about having curtains up in this apartment, but I feel like a total adult and I could not be more thrilled. It's definitely opened it up, made it a lot more bright and airy, which is exactly what I'm going for. So I hope you guys enjoy this video. It's a little bit more of a vlog style redecorating, just enjoying our Saturday off, hanging out, redecorating a little bit, putting the husband to work, nothing new here. So without further ado, let's jump right in and get to redecorating. Okay, so I have this hallway situation going on here and we have our hanging mirror on this door right here and then we also had this black circle mirror that's been here since we moved in but I've been thinking I want to swap this mirror for this frame that I got at Target because then whenever we take outfit pictures this is the background instead of another mirror so this mirror is definitely a beast to rehang, but I think I want it in the living room so it, it can reflect a little bit more light. I'm gonna go ahead and just do it and make the switch and yeah, we'll see how it turns out. living room i really love it i want to find a new spot for it but it's just a little bit too much because there's already a lot more going on in this living room than whenever i first hung that clock 
And then I'm gonna swap it out for another round wall decor piece. Um, but this is the mirror that I just took out of that hallway. And I really want a mirror in here so that way the light will bounce off the mirror and open up the room a little bit more. Not open it up, make it brighter. So this is gonna be a beast to hang and we have people coming over in like two hours. So I'm gonna try and hang this up as fast as I can. But um, I just like briefly hung it on a screw that the clock used to be on and I love the way it looks. So I'm super stoked about this one. I need you for five seconds. Let me just hold this so I can see. Just go about like three inches below that. Okay guys, so I took down these frames that were originally where we just hung our curtains and I could put them back up over there, but it's starting to feel a tiny bit cluttered. So I really wanna bring a little bit more cohesiveness to the kitchen because we have these open shelves right here and I love them, but they're definitely a little bit more eclectic. They're holding a lot more stuff, bringing in a little bit of like colors and warm tones. And then on our island right here, I have some stacked frames. I'm obsessed with the look of stacked frames. I incorporate that everywhere I can. But on this wall that's directly behind me, right in front of our bar cart, there's already a ton going on on the bar cart and the photos above it are also not symmetrical. Like one is vertical, one is horizontal. Um, that bothers me every single time I walk in the kitchen because it's just getting a little bit too eclectic for me. And I really want this open shelving and then the stacked frames to be the eclectic element. So, um, I'm thinking that I'm going to swap out those two Ikea frames for these three target frames that I just took down. Um, and then we actually just did a photo shoot with the best photographer. She's literally unreal. Her Instagram is Jordan Taylor photography. If you go on my Instagram, I've tagged her in plenty of photos, but we just did a shoot with her in her apartment. It was like a lifestyle shoot. So I really want to put those photos that she took in these frames but I haven't gotten a chance to get them printed yet. So I'm thinking what I'll do is just hang these today. They're definitely a little bit of a beast to hang. Um, I just hang them with thumbtacks. I know that that's frowned upon, but it's so fast and it's so easy to just pop them out whenever I go to redecorate, which is inevitable every few months around here. So I think I'm just gonna go for it and hang these behind the bar cart. The worst that could happen is I take it down. So um, I'm gonna go take those frames down that are there currently and then we're gonna put these up. I'm having second thoughts. I also, I was just staring at these and I love how large the mat is. 
I'm thinking I could also stack them. And that will bring the cohesiveness that I'm looking for. Also, the more and more that I decorate, the farther away I'm straying from light wood tones, I never thought I'd see the day. I always love light wood. I love anything that's super like bright. Um, never really wanted anything dark toned in here, but I really want to swap these out for the darker Ikea frames. That's been on my mind a lot lately. And then this frame is a little bit darker. I did the trick where you put clear tape over the brackets on the back and then you just mark it with the Sharpie where you need to put in your nail or in this case, thumbtacks. Um, Cause that first one took way too long. So this one will be a lot quicker. brings your eye all the way up to the ceiling right when you walk into the kitchen. Come see this work of art. Uh -huh. Does that look so much better? Perfect. Mm -hmm. It brings your eye up right when you walk in the kitchen because that wall is the first thing you see. I'm gonna put our photos with Jordan in there. That is all for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed and I will see you in my next video. Happy decorating.